Let's make a perfect reflection of a mirror inside Unreal Engine 5.5. First, I will download a simple asset from Quixel Bridge, and also we need a mirror material. I already have one, but for you, I will create the mirror material again. Right-click on Empty Area of Content Browser and click on Material, and then name it as you like, and double-click on it to open the material. Now hold 3 on your keyboard, and it'll add a color constant and change its color to white and connect it to base color. Now hold 1 from your keyboard and add 3 parameter constants C and set value to 1, and leave 3rd on default. Connect first one to metallic and second constant to specular and the last one to roughness, and your mirror material is ready. Now let's import that pillar asset to our project and drag it to our scene. Now let's add a cube and transform it into a mirror, and then we will apply our material to it. If you're wondering why my mirror is looking perfect with almost perfect reflections, then let's solve your problem right now. Let's add a post-process volume and then enable Lumen Reflections. And don't forget to set your volume to Unbound. After enabling Reflections, you also can change the max roughness of Reflections. The value totally depends on the environment of your scene. And I forgot to mention that if you want clean reflections, like I'm showing in my video, make sure your ray lighting mode is set to hit lighting for reflections. In my case, mirror reflection was accurate without post-process volume. The reason was, I always change my project settings for good reflections. So here go to rendering. Make sure global illumination and reflections are set to lumen. And the resolution for reflections is set to 128. I use 2048 value as minimum. And enable use hard ray tracing when available. If it's off, the reflections will be blurry or inaccurate. After disabling it, the reflection became blurry and also change ray lighting mode to hit lighting for reflections in project settings as well. It's perfect setting for reflections and Lumen require an NVIDIA RTX graphics card. And you can also see your character in mirror. If I click on play button and move in front of the mirror, it looks pretty accurate. That's it for today. I hope you learned something new.